Hello guys, we are back with our next set of video series. In this series, we are going to start the subject IoT guys. Guys, this is one of the most requested series. That is the reason why I am taking this guys. Okay. Yes. So IoT, it is nothing but internet of things guys. Okay. Guys, I am using a material which was provided by my friend. And his faculty has provided the notes guys. So that is the notes which I will be using in this lecture. As I did not write any kind of short note for this subject. Okay. Yes okay so let us first go through the definition guys okay so what is iot okay in simple words iot a network of interconnected objects able to collect and exchange data among themselves okay so basically it might be a sensor so basically whenever you hear the word iot the thing that comes to your mind is nothing but sensors right yes so basically these sensors or devices are connected to our internet to exchange data with some other devices okay yes so you might be asking me to say an example right okay so assume that you created you are trying to write a code for temperature sensor guys okay so assume that you bought the temperature sensor from the market okay and you connected to it to your arduino board or any kind of iot board okay and you start and you connected that board to your pc okay and now you started coding right Okay, so inside coding, you are checking the temperature and you are updating it in a server. Okay, yes. So via internet, this whole thing will occur, right? So in a server, it will update, right? Yes. So whatever this sensor will get the values. So those values are passed to the board and this board is connected to internet and from through with the help of this internet, it will transmit that data into the server, right? Yes. So this concept like exchanging data between devices through internet is nothing but internet of things guys so i think the image is not that much clear okay so this is an image for internet internet of things guys so basically here all the devices are connected to internet lane right yes so these are things you can say it as a internet of things okay yes so basically in simple words you can say an in a network of interconnected objects i told you right yes so similarly iot can be of a network of networks also so basically assume that this network belongs to transportation like in your locality like in your state transportation state education commission like that there are some networks assume in that way so if there is any connection between them okay and if it forms a proper thing so you can say that as also an internet of things guys okay yes so in simple words you can also say that internet of things is nothing but you can control some kind of device okay so these are really popular nowadays like automated fans and all those things right yes so in your home you will be having a fan and that fan will rotate okay so with the press of a button in your mobile right yes so these kind of things like controlling everything over the internet is nothing but internet of things right okay so i hope everyone got some basic idea about the internet of things right yes so the main vision or the goal of the internet of things is to automate a few things guys okay so the main goal is to automate things okay so here are some things i think so okay so the goal of internet is to enable things to be connected anywhere so basically assume that you are at your office and you noticed that you forgot to turn off your ac or your heater so in that situation instead of you coming to home and turning them off manually if there is an app in your mobile okay which is which will turn off these systems that will be a great thing right yes so basically these devices will have a sensor or near the button sorry near the switch of that particular machine you will be placing some machine so that it will turn off and turn on based on your commands right so this concept right so this is one of the goal and to automate few things so basically assume that you want to collect the temperature from some particular place guys okay so instead of a human being there and using thermometer or any kind of device to identify the temperature if you just place a sensor in that locality and if it is connected through to internet you can get the live values guys you can use many kind of applications okay so many kind of applications are available through which you can get the live values okay yes so these are the two main goals i think so so there could be multiple goals guys you can just go through the theoretical part okay so i hope everyone got some basic idea right yes so in the next lecture, we'll be discussing about the IoT strategic research and innovation directions. Okay. Yes. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching.